passage of scripture. People know about Zacchaeus. Amen. Zacchaeus, Jesus meets Zacchaeus as he is traveling through Jericho. Uh, by this time, Jesus was well known all over. And people were crowded together anytime he showed up. Amen. He had come to save that which was lost. <clears throat> what is interesting about this is most of the time when Jesus would be in a place, uh -huh. you know, not only did people travel far to get to him, but Jesus would a lot of times travel far to get to them. Yes. Amen. Amen. And most of the time when Jesus met people, he would ask this question, what will thou? Or what do you want? <laughs> people that came seeking Jesus, he would oftentimes say, what do you want? Amen. And many times he would heal them, deliver them. You know, he would do what they ask or whatever, but <clears throat> he would ask them, what do you want? Some showed uh, or, or, or you know, had to press their way to get to him. Because many times as he was traveling, like I said, it would be so many people gathered around trying to see him, trying to touch him, trying to get near him, trying to be blessed by him, that we heard about the woman with the issue of blood that pressed her way to touch the hem of his garment. Um... We heard about blind Bartimaeus who was sitting on the side of the road begging when he heard that Jesus was passing by, he started shouting. Yeah. And he started shouting so loud that even his disciples was telling him, be quiet, shut up, yeah. hold your peace. Amen. But this was different. I want you to look at something that you don't see when Jesus is meeting people, amen, amen. Look in verse 5. It says, and when Jesus came to the place, he looked up and saw him and said unto him, Zacchaeus, make haste and come down for today. I must abide Amen. at thy house. Amen. 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 See, we done heard about Jesus was traveling and a man would show up and say, Jesus, come my servant is sick. Come to my house. We heard people come and say, Jesus, my daughter is sick. Yeah. Jesus, my child is sick. Come to my house. And oftentimes Jesus will stop on his journey and go to their house. But this time Jesus said, Zacchaeus, I must go Amen. to your house. Amen. 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 Zacchaeus, I got to go to your house. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. What is it about Zacchaeus right, right, right. that Jesus is saying, I got to go to your house? Yeah. And now let me tell you something, because a lot of times when we look at this, this passage of scripture, we concentrate on the fact that he climbed a sycamore tree, and he did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amen. Amen. Jesus saw people climb on a roof right, right. and open it up That's right. and lower man down into it. 
So it wasn't such a big thing about Zacchaeus climbing the sycamore tree. Amen. There was something else about Zacchaeus. Amen. Amen. I want you to look at this here. Look at verse 8. It says, and, Zac and Zacchaeus stood and said unto the Lord, Behold, Lord, the half of my goods I have given to the poor, and if I have taken anything from any man by false accusation, he said, I restore him fourfold. Amen. That's it right there. That's it right there. I, I, I want you, okay. Yeah, I, I want y'all to look at this again. And Zacchaeus stood and said unto him, Lord, yeah, to the Lord, Behold, Lord, the half of my goods I've given to the poor. And if I have taken anything from any man by false accusation, I restore him fourfold. Let me tell y'all something what was special about Zacchaeus. By Jesus changing Zacchaeus' life, other folks was blessed. All right. Amen. Yeah. Amen. See, Jesus changing Zacchaeus' life don't just affect Zacchaeus. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. When Jesus changed Zacchaeus' life, the hope, the poor. Got blessed. Yeah, that's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. By changing his life. See, this is what we are missing about evangelism. Same. This is why we don't care about finding witness to people and bringing them to Christ. This is why we don't because we can't see the bigger picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amen. 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 We are a lot of times, and, 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 and it's sad because we've gotten into this type of Christianity that all we waiting on is our blessing, our yeah. increase, our, yeah. our, our, our. But it was something special about changing Zacchaeus' life. When Zacchaeus' life got changed, other folk life changed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So all of a sudden, Jesus is saying, Zacchaeus, I got to go to the cross. I got to shed my blood. <laughs> I got to be risen from the dead in three days. But before I do all of that, Zacchaeus, I got to go to your house. Yeah. Amen. Hey, I got to go in. Hey, a part of this plan is I go to your house. Mm. Hallelujah. 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 How many of us are looking for the Lord to bless us? Mm. But hey, how many others will profit Sad. Sad. from him doing or for what he going to do to you? Amen. All right. Amen. 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 Watch this. See, because if you notice, in verse 11 it says, And as they heard these things, he said, He added and spake a parable because he was nigh to Jerusalem, and because uh, they thought that the kingdom of God should come immediately, I mean, uh, uh, should, should uh, uh, immediately appear. Look, right after this, he started talking about this parable about these servants who was given stuff and some of them multiplied it yeah. and one of them yeah. didn't do nothing with it. That's right. yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Look, how many of us are celebrating today? How good God has been to us. How he has blessed us and how he has kept us and how he has done and how he has done that. But who else yeah, Lord, yeah, yeah, yeah. is blessed yeah, yeah. by you being blessed? Yeah, that's good. Hallelujah. 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 Do we even think about that? That God didn't just bless me. He didn't just 
just keep